Hey, we need to talk about something very important. The subscription-based models of uh, almost everything, the programs uh, that we are working on, like example, Adobe Primer Pro, or about uh, the AI, generative AI, applications almost everything is now going subscription based and I understand uh, partially why because people need to feed their own companies they need to give salaries to their employees and etc etc but in the same time isn't there anything that's uh, free with uh, adequate uh, let's say uh, usage or adequate uh, and I'm sick of that like subscribing to a model then to discover that the other model is better in a different way like uh, subscribing to GPT-4 and then discovering that perplexity is uh, better that uh, providing uh, more uh, of um, citation for example I asked GPT-4 for a link it doesn't provide you with a link uh, that from which they or from which it derived uh, its answers but perplexity does and uh, it does it far more better than GPT-4 but in the same time GPT-4 provides answers that is not provided by perplexity so I'm a bit uh, confused for example here I'm uh, checking for what is uh, FOMO or fear of missing out and uh, here it's um, in perplexity it shows me the sources NIH tech, ta tech uh, target very world mine fear of missing out Wikipedia I can check the links and here's the uh, output it gives us the um, the uh, triggers of anxiety and compulsive behavior like checking and refreshing sites it's also linked to a range of negative life experiences and feelings such as lack of sleep reduced life competency emotional tension negative effects on physical well-being anxiety and lack of emotional control this is an example of the perplexity output let's see the chat GPT-4 uh, output what is FOMO or fear of missing out it's simple it's more uh, concise and it is up to the point without mentioning any sources so in short I think that still the uh, GPT-4 wins but people need resources or citations so it's a win-win situation or win-lose situation for your money have a good uh, weekend and uh, see you later